From this steady flow of traffic on the A591, you get a clear view of one of Lakeland's most recognisable and famous spots. That is Helm Crag. Today, I want to find out why this miniature fell made it into AW's top six summits, despite being the only peak that he never got to the very top of. Situated in the very heart of the Lake District, Helm Crag is one of the lowest summits in Volume 3 of Wainwright's Pictorial Guides. It sits prominently at the end of a ridge which is easily reached from the village of Grasmere. As I head off to begin my walk, let's take a look at the route ahead. My walk begins in the heart of Grasmere village. The footpath takes me away from the tourist crowds and towards the western side of the fell. Here my route takes me across the National Trust estate at Allenbank. I'll head along the tarmac Easdale Road before heading into the woodland at the foot of Helm Crag. The engineered rocky stairway snakes its way up the breast of the fell, passing by Langcrig Crag. Jackdaw Crag and White Crag. From the path, there's a view across Easdale Beck to Easdale Tarn and the spectacular waterfall of Sour Milk Gill. But as my path hairpins to the right, I climb onto a ridge that gives me a view into the opposite valley, looking towards the pass of Dunmail Rays and the peak of Fairfield. Here, the final ascent leads to the summit ridge path. First, I'll approach the distinctive rocks that form the lion and the lamb, and then cross the boulder-strewn, craggy and desolate ridge top to reach the cannon-shaped barrel of rock, the howitzer, which is the mountain's true top. <laughs> 